All right, we are down at Patty Lou's Donuts in downtown Orlando today. I'm ready for the sweet treats. Let's see what's going on. Let's check it out. Donuts here, Patty Lou's. Now, Patty Lou's is in the heart of downtown. It's on Pine Street. Uh, Patty Lou's is relatively new, from what I know. Um, I haven't tried them. I think they're all the, the like the cake donut variety. So let's just go ahead and jump in. I got six. All right, I got a half a dozen here. So um, we are gonna see. Look at this. All right, so I got like the fruity pebbles, uh, cinnamon toast crunch, and the icings uh, like vanilla strawberry. Uh, I've got maple. Uh, you can see toppings of one of them is the um, marshmallows. I got Reese's peanut butter cup topping <laughs> and, uh, you know, again, fruity pebble and bacon bits, bacon on the maple, as you can see there. So I'm going to do all these individually. I don't think I'm going to eat them all, but you never know. Anything's possible. So um, let's do it again. I'm a cinnamon toast lover. Uh, I'm going to do that one first. So here it is. Okay, it's definitely a cake donut. So if you don't like cake donuts, probably not the best option for you because that's all they really make from what I see. So it's a cake donut. So how it works, you go in, you pick your, obviously the donut's one donut, so you get your donut and then you pick your, your frosting and then the third step, you pick your topping. So it's kind of like a make it as you go type thing. They're not all pre-made. Uh, but this cake donut does taste pretty fresh. Um. I really like the cake donut texture. It's not like too, it's not too thick and dense. It's like, it's soft. It's kind of crispy. I'm not sure on the frosting. Um, it's pretty good. I'm gonna say it's pretty dang good. All right, let's move on. I want to eat them all. Uh, you know, I never used to be understand bacon and maple, but I kind of do now. And there's bacon in my car now, but let's try it. Okay. Mm. Yeah, the salty is definitely coming through with the sweet. I love that. It's pretty good. Wow. Okay. I'm liking that. Again, I'm. When I walked in, it's kind of like, well, I'm not sure on the cake donuts. I read online that I know that's kind of what they do, but I said, well, I got to give them a try. I'm out in the area. So I'm pleased so far. All right, Fruity Pebble. And now I got Fruity Pebbles in my car. Here we go. Mmm, now that's good. It's so sweet. I mean, not overkill sweet. But the frosting's really good. I'm telling you, this is... I'm very impressed with these little donuts here. And again, they're not... They're not huge donuts. But I could see myself now... I didn't think so earlier, but I could see myself eating... But I could see myself eating the whole box. <laughs> you know, so not a good thing. All right, Reese's Peanut Butter Cup and Chocolate. They're like, we got to do that. That's like one of my tops too. There you go. All right, let's do it. Mm. Gosh, it's very good guys. I'm not gonna lie on this one, man. I mean,
again, I used to not be a big cake donut fan because I, every time I ate one, probably from the local supermarkets, they're just too like thick and like dry. But this is not the case. And the toppings, the frostings are all good. All right. Now I got two more. So I think this is like caramel and um, caramel marshmallow. Let's do it. Okay. Well, here's the thing. Like, there's so many different toppings. I just picked the ones that I thought would be great for me. But they have, like, shaved almonds. I think walnut, all kinds of different nuts. Um, pretty much so many different toppings. But I just took what I could. The ones that I think would be the most popular, most tasty to me. I'm not a big marshmallow guy, though. It's not really working for me, this one. Um, I can't figure out the syrupy topping. I'm not quite sure. I don't know if it's... Mm, not my favorite. But even you can't get past the cake. The cake donut is a really good cake donut. Alright, last but not least, M&M. Got M&M and like a, I don't know, it looks like a Nutella, Nutella topping. That's working for me too. Wow. Mmm. All right. Okay. All right, so I forgot my review yesterday after trying Patty Lou's donuts. I guess I was in a donut sugar coma. But anyway, I wanted to go ahead and just add that in here now and let you know again what I thought. So overall, my scale of one to 10, 10 being the best, one the worst, I probably give them about an 8.25, okay? So they were very good. Uh, again, the cake donut texture was not too dry. It was just right. It was crispy on the exterior and soft enough on the inside. Now. Uh, like I said, if you're if you're not a cake donut person and you like the traditional donuts, uh, this might not be the place for you because I think that's the only style donut that they do. But the good thing is if you like the cake donut and you like like all kinds of different toppings to try, that's kind of cool. You can get them made right then and there with your frosting, whichever you prefer, and then all the tons of different toppings they have. I didn't even come anywhere near, near trying every single topping. So. Uh, give those a shot. I think out the door for half a dozen donuts, I want to say it was around 13, 14 bucks or so. So, you know, everything costs us up. So they're right around there, probably for the range where you want to be. But um, they do do coffees and other things. I think they did ice cream, but I'll leave a link in the description of uh, their website so you can check them out. But anyway, have a fantastic day. And as always, just stay amazing.